Okay, hi everybody. Hi everybody. Um, I just thought I'd make a short video and show you the range of motion of this thing. I've got uh, an already made uh, loop back um, with the um, false belly glued in and it's attached to my mold holder. So it's basically the same setup as I had when the back was on the mold, but the mold is gone. So it's a lot lighter to handle, and it's easy to move around. I mean, just back this cap off a bit. So it moves side to side really easily, and uh, there are a couple of knurled handles underneath here. And if you back them off, then there's a turntable. Sort of a Lazy Susan thing, um, where you can move it in that direction. And you just tighten those knurled handles. And lift it up, and there you go. And so you're scraping in any direction, any orientation. So okay, if I want to work on the bottom, the very bottom, just turn it that way. And yeah, carefully set that up. Shut off the overhead light, and I can see exactly where my rib lines are. Right? I can uh, scrape that. And I can, you know, if I'm getting ready to um, fit a neck. Then I will work with it this way, and I can, you know, work all around this uh, this top block area where the where the neck joint's going to be. So it's great. I love it. I I, I love taking a a thing that I've made and then finding another use for it or extending its use or you know it just becomes this organic machine that just keeps building on itself. And I hope, I'm sure I'll find other uses for this setup too. Anyway, that's my thing.